Hello, my beautiful guy, and this is episode 3 of my Terraria Xbox 360 Let's Play Adventuring Thingamajig. And in this episode, I want to make my house look proper, because as you can see, it's not very proper right now. And also make it livable in for NPCs and such, because I think that'll stop uh, the dude from walking in and out. Because he's really annoying just doing what he does. Although now he's going into my mind, so that's good. Um, I'm also contemplating going to hell, because um, I know once you go below a certain depth, uh, you can... You know, find the underworld, and I know a way to dig now because I played the tutorial. See, so much goes back to that. So first of all, what we want to do is just get rid of all of this because it's, you know, it's messy and doesn't really achieve very much. There we go. Um, and then we'll replace it all with wood uh, later. Uh, but first of all, we have to get rid of the old before we can come in with the new. So uh, this should be just about good enough. Should we get rid of this as well? Uh, then we'll use the axe and get rid of the wood. Bam. Um, as well as this. And then what we'll do to uh, actually make the house a house, we'll go into man- oh god damn it, I did that wrong. Uh, we'll go into manual mode, uh, which is my new- I don't have any wood on me, do I? Yeah, I really should have done that first. Uh, well, I've got seven wood, which is good, I guess. Uh, so I'll place the seven wood I need to play. You know, you know that's good, that's better, that's all that really counts. So we'll chop down some trees first, just like a lot of trees. Um, I actually quite like manual mode, like I might use this just full time, because uh, although, wait, why, how is this chopping down that tree? That doesn't even, that, well that doesn't make sense now. Uh, also if you wonder why I'm a green dude with an afro, still don't have a real reason, just figured, eh, that's a good idea, right? So, <laughs> that's my reasoning right there. Also look at this, this is how you chop down trees in real life, by the way. I mean, you just sort of swing in the general direction and then bam, stuff happens. Uh, so we'll chop down this tree now. Uh, how much wood are we going to go for? I don't think we'll need more than like 100, so we'll go with like, I don't know, 40, 50. Uh, ideally, I just want a really big tree that I can just chop down and then be done for the year, but there's not that many big trees in Terraria, unfortunately. Uh, I also really want to explore the world, go all the way to the right at some point. See, there's, there's quite a few objectives that I have to deal with, and uh, I'm going to slowly work on them one by one. So first of all, let's kill this slime. Um... I also really want a bow, so that's the first thing I'm building out. No, wait, that's the first thing I'm building out behind is a pickaxe, then I'm building a bow, I should say. Because um, I really want a bow, and yeah, they're, they're good and stuff, in my opinion. Uh, so now what do we do? We'll just, I guess we can slowly get rid of all of these blocks. This, that, and that. Um, then we get rid of these two blocks. Oh, nope. See, this is, manual mode is just a bitch. Like, there we go, see? Um, so from here, then we can uh, use the wood. We'll build across, and bam, we've got ourselves a little thingamajig or something. And that's, I guess that's the end of the house this way. We could also extend the house downwards. So, wait, if I go like that, and then, so what I want to do is like sort of uh, make the house go out further to the right. I use my hand for a gesture again. Uh, so first, we'll chop down these two trees. That's step one in the process. Um, and then, you'll, you'll see what I mean in a second. Uh, because uh, the more rooms you have in your house that can have NPC villagers live in them, the more NPC villagers will move in. And uh, you need NPC villagers for stuff, which is... Uh, well, I'm not sure if they're called villagers. Pro it's probably just the Minecraft in me. I, I offend so many people with the Minecraft uh, comparison, then confuse so many others by not. It's just like, god damn it, there is no right, is there? Um, actually, what I need to do here is have platforms. Uh, so first of all, we'll go to the crafting bench, uh, then we'll go to Y, and then craft some platforms, um, wooden platform, we'll, oh, I've already got 20, so, then we just need to move these to the, uh, wait, it's, I'm still getting used to the Terraria thing, by the way, um, having some real problems adjusting to the control scheme or whatever, uh, so wooden platform's already in my inventory, I don't know why I had so much issue then, uh, so what we need to do is just have wooden platforms, like, there, 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 and there, and then we can go back to wooden floor, if I'm right. And then basically I can go up and down like this, and that should be cool. Um, actually, how, how, how high can you jump? Because in theory, I could just get rid of all of this wood here and just... Yeah, I think I'll, I'll give that a shot. Can I... No, I still need to have a block, so I guess I could just make a platform here. Like, uh, have a platform there, there. Uh, do I need one there? As... Yeah, I do need one. Uh, then we'll chop down this piece of wood. And uh, bam, the house is going places, and uh, yeah. I'm see the house doesn't look like just pure shit anymore, which is that's a good thing. Um, so now all we need to do is sort of uh, also is this high enough? I think it has to be six. Yeah, it's, this is six high. Uh, so now we're gonna like chop a hole in the wall here. Uh, am I in manual? I'm in, now I'm in manual mode. Uh, so now we just make a uh, like like a door thing here. I also want to have one on the other side, but first I'm doing this side, um, and then there'll be a room over here. So uh, shall I just 
copy. Yeah, I'll just go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, just for safe measures. Uh, and then we'll just stack up and do the same thing that I was just doing. Um, actually, I think for stacking up, see, this, this, like, this is the problem with having two control schemes. Some things are better for like for one part of it, and some are better for the other. I think I, I'll just get used to manual mode personally. Um, because it saves me having to deal with all the other things that come along with it. But this is uh, House de Toy Cats so far. Uh, as you can see, it's going some lovely places. Now I can get rid of all of this and then just sort of wood it off, if you know what I mean. Um, by just uh, going like this. Can I reach up there? No, I can't. Wait. Ah, there we go. And now we should just be able to make everything look all fine and dandy. And uh, bam! We've got ourselves... Oh, wait. That's not bam. Um... Then from here, we should be just about fine. Uh, for some reason, it's not me. Oh, final block. No, it's not okay. I'm going to have to go on the other side of this wood. Uh, place it there. And now we can get everything else in the house, which is good. That's really good. So uh, basically, this is just something I, I'm playing for my second channel. Uh, you'll see it at some point. It's not actually that interesting, like, in gameplay-wise, but it's the coolest idea for a game ever. Uh, basically, they take real-world statistics, like, so many statistics from the real world. Uh, and then it just, uh, you press, like, start game, and it... Based on the statistics, it you know works out where you'd be born, or it just you know you know where you would be born on average, and then I don't know. It's it just it blows my mind how crazy it is. Um, I think you have to, uh, and then like you can be like born in India as a girl, and then you have to decide you know I want to get myself married or something, or you know it's it's just it's crazy mind blowing craziness. Um, <laughs> also, I'm spending my daytime working my house. That's probably something I should be doing. Uh, I guess I want to go chop down some trees, so uh, we'll use that as an opportunity to... Oh, I need to chop into this uh, wood, don't I? Uh, not this wood, this uh, this this dirt, like, because I need a way in and out of the house. And I don't think there's... Well, I guess I could use platforms, because this... Oh, I could, actually. I might as well. Uh, so we'll put some plat... And that will also stop uh, this dude from letting in skeletons and zombies and stuff. I don't think they're actually skeletons, but... It is so annoying, like, I... I know I, know I complained about him last episode, but wow, I was just like, you are... You do not deserve to be alive right now, Mr. Garrett. Uh, also, that green slug. Okay, never mind. Slime's gone. Um, where? Yay! Uh, lots of wood for Toy Cat. Uh, so, I'm going to go with like maybe 100 or so, as I said. Ooh, wow, look how tall these trees are. These are the trees you want to be going for. Uh, there's also mushrooms, which I believe are used to help potions. That's always a fun time. But yeah, the game, you just like. And then you make decisions, like uh, going to work and school, then it alters your statistics and stuff, and you age up a year every time. And just every now and then, you just. Like, I, I died of asthma. I just had a random asthma attack and died. And it's like, wow, that's that's crazy. Um, but I, I'm, I'm trying to find more games like that for my second channel because I find them hilarious to play and, like, people are enjoying them. Like, um, games like Don't Die, Date, Stummy, like, date, I guess, I don't want to say dating simulators because that makes me sound like a lonely old 80-year-old dude. Um, which I guess there is probably some level of truth to. Uh, well, I guess there's no level of truth to that, I'll actually come to think of it. Also, I'm killing so many slimes. Uh, okay, now they're killing me, but, you know, at some point I was killing slimes. Uh, slimes have all the gels you need for torches, so I'm, I guess this is good. Otherwise, I just wouldn't bother. I'd be like, yeah, I'm just going back to my house now. You enjoy what you're doing here, slimes. Uh, so we'll chop down this one last tree, hopefully, assuming the slime doesn't get to me first. Um, and then we... Oh, that's nice. I, I love the amount of stuff that comes dropping down from a tree. Uh, so we're going to ignore that slime. Uh, I really want to know what to do with this ball and star. Let's see what happens when we press right trigger. Oh, you just pull it out for a second, and then nothing happens. Okay, that's... I guess that's interesting. It's not that int... Ah, uh, whatever. It's it's what it is. Um, so we're welcome making the house more for house now, because uh, there are certain conditions you have to meet for... Um, what is that? That's a slime just sort of... I don't know what's happening there. Uh, but now he's in the house, uh, and now it's with Garrett to deal with. Is he called Garrett? Yeah, he is called Garrett. Uh, so what we're doing uh, to dig down, if you're wondering, which is something I'm going to work on at the night time, uh, is I'm going to just uh, use platforms and just dig down like that. Because on my PC version, I didn't do that, and I feel silly for it. Uh, also, this does not seem like it's 10 blocks. I It probably is, but I'm, I'm worried it's not. Um, but whatever. Uh, so now we'll just wood up, wooden, um, wall the whole house up. Uh, which means we need to make wooden walls, of course. So, uh, first of all, we'll move the copper ore because we don't really need that. Actually, we might as well smelt that. Uh, or just... Actually, I think I had problems trying... Oh, I just threw that on the ground. Um, so, I I think I had problems smelting, if I was right, because I had no idea how to do it. Uh, still don't have any ideas to do it, but we'll give it a quick look. 
Uh, if not, then I, I'm sure it's something that can just wait for tomorrow. Okay, yeah, I, I can't see where it, you would do it. Maybe it's in under, like, brick? Yep, there we go. Oh, wait, that's brick. Uh, how, how would I go about making... What? I just... What, what did I just do? I don't, I don't know what I just did. Uh, <laughs> so uh, we need to make wooden walls, I believe they're called. So, uh, wood wall? Yep, wall. We'll just make a lot of wooden walls. Um, so then with these wooden walls, we'll... First of all, we need to get that slime away from my house, because he's getting in the way. Also, silver bricks don't really want those. Uh, so, where are the wooden walls at? There are the wooden walls at. So I hope that's enough. I don't know if it actually will be. Uh, so we'll just place this around everywhere. Um... Again, manual mode's going to work wonders for this. Um, and then, bam, we've got ourselves a furnished house, which NPCs can move into. Because uh, I just want to have that in the background, so that way NPCs can move in if they really want to. Uh, I think there's actually quite a few more requirements, like you need a chair in every room, and there's probably have a couple few ones I'm missing. Uh, but I've got the main ones, and that's all that counts. Um, also, we want to torch this place up a little more. Uh, we'll put a torch there as well, and then one all the way up there. Maybe, wait, that, let me... Let me place it there. Why won't it let me? Oh, because I ran out of torches. <laughs> uh, I feel silly now. So we'll make a lot of torches. Uh, I think I think 51 should cover me for a while, maybe. Um, but yeah, now we're just about done. I just The only thing I'm sort of missing is I need to chop down these... Oh, I can do that like this. Uh, and now we've got ourselves a fully furnished house. We just need to cover it in walls. Um, so we're going to go over wooden wallpaper. Uh, just go... Whee! That's nice. Um... Do the whole second layer, except I'm doing I'm doing this awfully, and I'm missing out gaps that they, I, I'll just I'll just build them out in manual mode afterwards. Uh, I want to check this is ten blocks. So one, two. I'm not convinced this is ten blocks, but whatever I can I can deal with that by myself. Also, Garrett, what are you doing? You are you are making me just feel bad about being alive. So please stop that. Um, we can make some more wooden walls, I guess, or we could start the descent to hell, and I quite like that second option. Uh, actually, first we'll make some doors so it's all doored up and everything, uh, because you do need doors to separate the rooms, because that's just how that works, apparently. Uh, so, first door over here, wait, there. Uh, second door, I only need two doors, I realised, but whatever. Um, and then third door, because we will expand the house this way eventually, uh, we'll just have a third door over here. Uh, so... That just leads to nowhere right now, but at some point it'll move to somewhere, and then that will be a justified purchase or something. Uh, so first of all, yeah, let's work on the way to hell, because I want to want to get the road to hell going, because obviously that's a good thing to do. Um, so first of all, we're going to... Also, if you're wondering uh, what the video schedule is going to be like uh, for the next few days, uh, I don't really know. I'm just sort of waiting for the Minecraft update, and uh, in the meantime... I think we'll just do Terraria as well as a little bit. I, I don't complete now. I don't complete now. Figured I'd give you guys an update. Also, my live streaming thing. I think I'm going to be live streaming most weekdays next week, like Tuesday, Thursday. X, I, I, why am I explaining weekdays to people? Uh, <laughs> but uh, starting from Monday, because I think I'm doing something on Monday. Uh, I don't know what yet. As it, and by something, I mean something like uh, if real life wise. Um, and then, okay, so I've, I, I'm just going to do platforms like this, and then, yeah, that, so all I have to do now is just dig down and hope for the best. Um, I, am I free wide or am I too wide? I guess I'm too wide, but I was standing in the middle of the blocks. Uh, and yeah, this is my plan to get to hell. Uh, hell was meant to be a really cool place, because there's just, like, people that are like, whoa, I'm, I'm in hell, and there's laser beams, and I think I'm exaggerating when I say laser beams, but... I don't know. It's it's meant to be cool, and I look forward to cool things because cool things are cool, as you you might be aware from the title of said cool things. Um, also, is this enough for me to? Oh, it's not. Um, <laughs> so we'll place a wooden platform there and there. No, I won't let me place it because I'm in the way. Um, also, there's got to be a better way to get light down here than just placing torches every like eight blocks. Maybe I could turn up my brightness or something. I don't know. I'm. Oh, do you see this on the left? Uh, but first of all, we'll place platform there and there. Then we'll place one there and there. And then, bam, we've got ourselves a magic little system that can get us down and up in a heartbeat. Not really a heartbeat. Heartbeats are actually, like, 
I don't know, they're not as fast as people seem to suggest when they say, I'm going to do that in a heartbeat. Uh, I don't know whether that's misleading or, or what, but I'm not happy with it. Um, since the heart only beats like 70 times like a minute, that's that's not... Ooh, I see some more. See, I've I've already found some wonderful, wonderful things in um, Terraria by just digging down. Uh, so we'll take all of the iron ore with us because, as I said, I, I don't know how why it won't let me smelt, but I do want an iron pickaxe and an iron bow, so... Gonna need a lot of iron since it's five iron ore for every, like, iron bar, and then you need a lot of iron bars to make a... Um, uh, make stuff in general, so you need a lot of ore, is what I'm trying to say here. Um, we'll place a torch there, and then we'll place platforms like there and there. Um, why didn't why, where did the torch go? There we go. Uh, so now we'll just mine all of this iron ore, because uh, iron ore is lovely and stuff. Also, apparently I missed silver ore last episode, I already should go back and check that. But on the other hand, I want to find hell. I want to know what this hell thing is all about. Uh, also, I could just find a cave system, like, uh, I'm actually quite likely, it's got the same Minecraft thing where you can just find random cave system, uh, randomly generated cave systems. Uh, as you can see, there's one to the bottom right of my screen right now. Uh, I'm also quite a fan of the way it does the lighting, like, uh, I can sort of see stuff, but sort of not at the same time. Uh, I know, I like that quite a bit. Probably just me, but, you know, I'm an important person, my opinion really counts, so, that's, I don't know what I'm saying. Um, <laughs> also, is there a Oh no, that's my afro. I thought I thought there was a grey block above me, and I was like, why is that there? And now I know. Also, gold ore. Ooh, gold ore, gold ore. I want the gold ore. I want the gold ore. Give me the gold ore. I don't know why I'm having such problems mining. I'll go into auto mode for mining, actually. Uh, it's, 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 it's actually, as I said, it's just, there's some things you need some things for, some things you need the other. And this is one of those uh, auto mode type things. So we're going to have a lot of gold ore for us now. Um, we could finish off this... Uh, this little go. Oh wow! Okay, there's a lot of water there that I don't want flooding into my cave, so we'll just have to let that go. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> I don't know what the exact number of blocks are that you can move with. Uh, what, you, what the blocks are you can jump, but apparently I keep messing it up. Oh, this see, there we go. Uh, so now we can head up to the surface, see what's going on there. Um, I guess I still have to wallpaper my house, and then I have to dig down a lot more. But um, See, it's, we made some developments this episode, and that's all that really counts. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed this episode so far. Um, I know you're enjoying the series. Uh, if you have any ideas, let me know, because I don't really know what I'm doing. Uh, and ideas are appreciated. So uh, if you have any ideas, just let me know with the commenting thing, the jig. Uh, live streams next week, like Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Probably like two or three of those days. Uh, so thanks for watching the video, and... Goodbye.